Hey everybody, it's Gamerongi. We're back with Okami. Last time we got the last Satomi Power Orb and got our way into the Gale Shrine. So hopefully we can take on this Crimson Helm character. Once we make our way through here. But first, I'm gonna get these treasures because, heck yeah, treasure. Oh, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up! Oh, okay. So that way is... Uh, looks important. What's this way? Zip, zip, zip. Zip, zip, zip. Oh, hello. It's a devil gate. Crazy chamber pot monkey with a snake tail. Oh, and tiger legs. Okay, uh, I don't know what to do, but slash. <laughs> Maybe not the best. Okay, that wasn't it. A bomb? A bomb? Okay, uh, shoot. I really don't know what kind of floral finisher. A slash? Wow, it was. Two demon fangs. Heck you. Yeah. Nice. Ooh. One of those exorcism arrow key things. Uh, all right then, cool. So off screen, uh, I actually started spending some of my praise. I got an extra health, an extra ink, and uh, increased my wallet size. So now I can hold, I guess, 999,999? Which is good. Uh, I think I can actually afford another ability at the dojo right now. Golden Fury, <laughs> which is a really hilarious and messed up ability, but it gets you demon fangs, so maybe I'll get that uh, eventually. Or I could just keep doing floral finishers. Or both. I wonder if you could do both. I don't know. But yeah, it costs 100000 for that, so <laughs> a little bit expensive. Ooh, wind-powered walkway dealie. I don't need to examine this. I can tell what it is, Isun. Aha, good. Good, 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 good. Got a bunch of pots and pots and pots. Should I be breaking these pots? I don't know. Oh yeah, and I found out that like, when your astral pouch is full and you get food, it actually adds to your yen total. So it's never a waste to pick up food because it, it gives you money. <laughs> yeah, like that. I just got, I guess I got some fruit and I added to my yen. I think, pretty sure. Okay, so this is a weird elevator here in the Gale Shrine. Uh, you can tell by the middle, it's, you have to put a bomb there to make it move anywhere. If I can draw it. <laughs> it's so crazy. I like how fast it moves. Just like... Hello, blue scroll. Creeping me out with your blue scrollness. There's a flaming chest here. Uh, don't touch it. Oh wow, we're going up in the in the windmill. Look how high up we are. Sweet. All right, should I fight this thing?
Uh, good thing I did. Because I had to. Wow. Alright then. <laughs> Man, so when you blow up that crazy water thing, water creature, uh, I guess the water spewing out hurts you? So, good to know. Let's go to the third floor. Let's go to the third floor. Okay, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Before it goes down. Come on, that was a perfect one. <laughs> Hello. Wow, are we almost at the top? Woo! Wow, this is not a very big uh, dungeon. I guess we did have to do a lot of stuff with the Satomi Canine Warriors, though. And actually, we may have more of this place left. I thought this was like near the end of it, but maybe not. Oh, we're so high up. Hello, birdie. Do not fall. Unless you want to. Hey, maybe you do. I don't know. Nope. <laughs> this would be a really mean place to hide a chest down, like, down below on a platform or something. Zip dip dip. Zip dip doo. Oh, that's right. We have that rotating bridge down there. Never mind. There's probably more to go. Now that's one big windmill. I saw it from down in the village, but I had no idea it was this big. Hey, what's that? It's swirling around in front of the big windmill. Almost looks like wind, but it's black and foreboding. It's as if the wind were being forced in the opposite direction. I wonder if that swirling evil air is what stopped the windmill. Maybe that's why the divine wind stopped blowing. If so, it must be the work of that Crimson Helm. wonder how we can get rid of the evil air. By going the opposite direction. Ooh. See? I knew that would bring the Divine Wind back. This one's flowing out. Just do what you did before. Draw over the swirling evil air in the opposite direction. So we're gonna go out to in. Okay, one more left. Gotta blow the rest of that evil air clear out of here. Whoop. Hey, come on. That was flawless. Oh my god, really? <laughs> it is going that way, right? Okay. What? Now it's telling me what to do. I did it that way every time, Isun. Come on. All done. Now that the divine wind's back, I bet the big windmill will... Oh, snap. Yes, yes, yeah! The big windmill is a turning again. It's starting to spin. Look how strong the divine wind's blowing. Oh my god. Sure hope this drives away the evil down in Kusa Village. Me too. Hmm? Now what? Constellation, of course. We just learned a new brush technique. Come on.
It's a Rapidash. Or a Ponyta. I don't know. Uh. Ah, Matarasu, origin of all is good and mother to us all. For too long, I, Kazagami, god of wind, have walked a shadowed path. At last, light shines upon me. Use my power to manipulate the wind. Banish those who would seek to shroud this world in darkness. I shall. I bet it was the divine wind that brought the wind got back. Now you can use Kazagami's Gale Storm brush technique. Just draw the mark of Kazagami to create wind. Let's try it out. Hey, that windmill looks like a good target. Draw the wind mark just like you did on that swirling evil air. Let's try to make that windmill spin. Spin spins out of wind. Yes. We're free! Ah, oh, what a refreshing wind! And that door opened when the small windmill started spinning. This wind is nothing to sneeze at! You should try this brush technique on a variety of things. There's no time for us to rest on our laurels. The big windmill is sending the divine wind down to the village. But that crimson helm still lurks somewhere in the, in the Gale Shrine. And that serpent crystal Waka mentioned has piqued my interest. Let's turn this place upside down until we find both of them. Okie dokie. Ah, right, look at that. Yeah, I don't know why, but like... I played this game twice, and I had no idea you could uh, make wind blow forward and towards you. I always thought you had to do it side to side. But yeah, if you do these spiral shapes, you can actually make it blow forward. Like if you go from out to in. It's forward, and then from in to out, it's back this way. I had no idea. I like read that in one of those scroll things. <laughs> oh, oh my god. Look at this sneaky, sneaky thing. Give it to me. Ooh, sun fragment. Was that the third one? Collect three of these bright fragments to extend solar energy by one unit. You have collected three! Extra health. Oh yeah. Okay, cool. Zipper up, up, up. I mean, you even had to make a spiral in that little tutorial right there, where you had to like undo the evil winds. But for some reason, I just never really grasped that you could do that. <laughs> and yeah, I can. I guess I can blow out these fires. I said these fires. Uh huh. There's another way we can put out those fire chests. Delios. Speaking of, there's one on the second floor too. Oh, and one right there. Hmm? Wait a sec. It's a treasure chest. I bet you could put the fire out without using water now. Truth. Truth. Gale Shrine map. That is quite the map of this floor. <laughs> really gotta start using my head more. It's just so convenient to slash them all at once. Okay. Can I get to the second floor without having to take the elevator again? Doubtful. Oh, that wasn't even the door. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> okay. What is in this? I'll get good at wind someday. 
Free bead. Wow, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Vanilla ice. Oh. Almost did it. <laughs> okay. To the wind bridge. This one. So what I'm talking about. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm, 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 mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Blow. Let the wind blow. Yes. Yosh. Brush tips. <laughs> Telling me how to use my wind gusts. Is this here a creature? Is there something in here? Sounds like rats. <laughs> Probably up in the rafters. Like a bunch of jerks. Oh dear. Wind! Oh, come on. Oh dear. I cannot see anything. <laughs> Lacquer wear. Perfect. Thank you. I wonder if I just have to draw it slower for that to work all the time. Steel Soul Sake. Mm hmm. I don't trust just jumping. Oh. Hey, yeah. Wind it up. Oh, come on, what? It doesn't seem that difficult of a shape to draw, but for some reason it just doesn't want to work all the time. <laughs> Aha! I found you, rats. Found you. Take some seeds. Your little... Templeton rat bellies. The fair is a veritable smorgasbord, orgasbord, orgasbord, after the crowds have ceased. Ugh. That song is so good. Okay. Hopefully... There's not too much left up here. Oh, hey! Whoa! Check out those massive hanging scrolls! Looks like they're enjoying that wind you brought back to life. But be careful! It'll blow away... Uh... Oh, it'll blow us away if it gets much stronger. Um... Maybe not. Oh, dang! Is this the way I'm supposed to go? Oh, no. I... Yes, it is, actually. But... I gotta get this. <laughs> All right, we'll go back up there. In a moment. I can finally do these crazy scrolls. I probably blew them around right there, but yeah. Blowing and jumping. I hope I do this right. For some reason, when I jump on these scrolls, I always have so much trouble. Well, I don't, I don't know if I have trouble, but it freaks me out. <laughs> Cause like, I don't know, this game has weird edge, so, like you can't walk over edges, so it's a little weird doing platforming. You don't know what the heck is going to happen. <laughs> Especially with these weird moving platforms. Okay. Sweet. Wooden bear. Wooden bear ain't got no hair. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. We did it with no trouble. No trouble at all. This looks really mysterious and spooky. And all together ooky. Hello. I think we might be right at the end. Which is crazy. 
This really isn't a big dungeon. <laughs> it's cool though. Um. Okay, maybe not. Maybe we're not as close as I thought. Gotta blow that fire. Sweet. Who puts giant torches in the middle of a hallway? Cribs in hell? Uh-oh. Speaking of. Spooky town. Spooky music. Hmm? You see that, Ami? Some kind of crystal. Looks like a berry or something. That looks pretty neato. I bet it's the serpent crystal for dispelling Orochi's barrier. You know, the item that Waka guy was searching for? Sweet, we found it before he did. Ha ha ha. Get on, loser. Crimson Helmet? Hey, it must be Crimson Helm! <laughs> it really does look like one mean dude. Better psych yourself up for this one, Furball. I'm psyched, I'm psyched! Jeez. Ooh, hello. What the heck? Aren't these the Satomi Power Orbs? Are they gonna protect us or something? Really? Well, all right. So yeah, this is Crimson Helm. He's a freaky looking dude. Whoa! Actually, his helmet looks like, uh... Something familiar. Whoa! That we'll find later. <laughs> but anyway. I don't think we can really do anything yet. Maybe we can. Whoa! Oh god, he's lighting himself up. There we go. Okay, yeah, these orbs are gonna protect me from hits. That's nice. Good. Oh my god. It's a really creepy cow skeleton. <laughs> They like bombs. Oops. I'm gonna keep using them on you, buddy. I said. Whoa, that's a really bad one. <laughs> it worked, though. Oh, no! Oh, blah, blah, blah. oh really? Uh -huh. Boy, I'm so glad these things are protecting me right now. <laughs> Wind it up. Bomb. Slash. Wow, oh, just keep slashing. It's really effective. Okay. Wow, one more of those. We're good. One more. Oh dear. Bullets! <laughs> oh dear. Whoa! Alright, buddy. I'm going down. Wow, one hit, really? <laughs> Thank you. 
Huh? Is he chickening out? After him, Ami, quick! Oh, Susano? Back you, cur. I'll handle this one. Charge! What the heck's he doing? He's gonna get sliced and diced. Time for some brushwork, Ami. Okay. Hey up! Take this! Take that! And that! And to top it off, now for some wind. Okay, hopefully I don't screw it up. Yes, wind! More wind! <laughs> now you're talking. Wait, there's more! <laughs> How much do you need? Behold the secret technique! Wind of Wrath! Whoa. That was pretty pro, dude. Now I'm positive. This is not my doing. It's the gods. They toy with me. Will you never stop mocking me? You hear me up there? Are you happy now? Oh, why must I bear this burden of being Nagi's descendant? All I wish is to live in peace. Do you enjoy dogging my every step? You okay, Pops? Blast you gods! I don't want your power. This whole world can fall to ruin as far as I'm concerned. Enough of these legends and Nagi's descended stuff. Now just leave me be. Uh oh. Ooh, what the heck's that? Yikes! Huh? G -g go away! Huh? That voice! One after the other. You're driving me crazy! Stop it! I don't want to hear about that now! Go away! Leave me alone! What was that, Ami? That was a spooky thing. Divine instrument, life beads. Rosary that draws upon pure life energy to destroy evil. Oh, how wonderful. Bonjour. Oh, am I interrupting something? Waka, come on, man. <laughs> oh, brother, it's that half-baked prophet again. Half-baked. You soon that's your new favorite adjective, isn't it? Hey, that's... that's... What, this? It's the serpent crystal. And it's mine at last. <laughs> Got a lot of nerve muscling in on our goods like that. We found it first. It won't do you any good. I mean, I'm the only one who can dispel the barrier with it. You know, the barrier at the moon cave, Orochi's stronghold? I do now. Well, <laughs> I guess he told us that before. Hmm? You calling me, big boy? <laughs> Keep your scales on, I'm coming. Oh, snap. Hey, what's going on? Why are you going over to Orochi's place? <laughs> oh, 
I almost forgot. Time for another prophecy. I foresee a rendezvous with a sweet little thing. Anyway, I must be off. Au revoir, baby. A sweet little thing. Now you wait a second. Dispel the barrier at the moon cave. What the heck's he's up to? This is no time for your victory, Hal Furball. We gotta get out of here and get on with our mission quick. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. Wow. Had to be. I guess doing a lot more damage during that skeleton phase. <laughs> Would you like to save? Yeah. Why, my favorite wolf and little bug have safely returned. When the windmill at the shrine began spinning, I knew it was you. A most refreshing wind began to blow down to, into our village. You have defeated Crimson Helm and restored the divine wind. The canine warriors rejoice, but they're a handful as usual. I don't know how to thank you for all you've done. I too would like to give thanks to these heroic travelers. And Princess Fuse, last of the Satomi house, you have done well. What? You know Princess Fuse? Man, it is really blurry. <laughs> Why is it so blurry? Indeed I do, for I was her husband and head priest of the shrine. My lingering fears about Kusa village kept my spirit here. But thanks to you, I can now travel to the great beyond. Princess Fuse and the canine warriors still have much to learn, but I have no doubt that they will prosper. I shall watch over them. Farewell. I shall pray for your good health and prosperity. Oh man, Princess Fuse's husband. That's unfortunate. What is it, you two? What were you looking at? Hmm? Oh, nothing. Anyway, Princess, there's no need to thank us. Just keep protecting the village as head priestess of the shrine. I know you'll have your hands full with those pesky canines. I've been rather feeble since the last head priest perished. But as head priestess, I shall now de dedicate my life to the shrine while keeping the remaining five canine warriors in line. That's a spirit. That's a spirit. Wow. That's the praise as well. Thank you. Seeing Princess Fusei smile gives us new strength. Wow. Never expected to hear those words from you. Okay, so I've already, like, fed all these guys, right? Can't feed them again? Okay. Just make it sure. Thank you, Princess Fusei, for all your magical dealings and stuff. And dogs. All the dogs. Hey, wait, I didn't get, like, the best damage score on that fight, did I? I wonder if losing those Satomi power orbs counts against you. <laughs> I guess it must. Whoa there, furball. Let's think about our next step before we scurry off. Is that shadowy creature with those heads really that monster? You mean Orochi? Our future's pretty bleak unless we do something about it. I mean, I'm too young to die. I'd like a chance to use all the brush techniques too. He didn't even so much as growl at that shadowy creature. You slayed that monster long ago, right? I bet your partner Nagi was the stronger of you two. Wow. Or maybe that legendary sake really packed a punch. Yeah, it must have been the sake. Ami, the legendary sake is back in that village, isn't it? You mean Kamiki? Why aren't you just saying the names? Isn't it about time for that village's annual festival? Let's go see what, if we can taste that special brew. This might do us some good. Besides, a good festival is always fun. If I could get Sakuya a little tipsy, then maybe. <laughs> Maybe what? Ami, I suddenly feel like a new man. Let's go. Isun, you got props. You got props. Super duper props. 
Okay, well, uh, hmm. Maybe I should end it. Eh? <laughs> Next time, we'll, uh, head off to Kamiki for the festival, I guess. And, uh, I might stop at some things now that we have the power to blow wind everywhere. Uh, we can actually do quite a bit. We can put out the fire chests, we can mess with those tapestry dealios. And, uh, man, that's about it. So, uh, I'll see you guys next time for a lot of, uh, random things. Goodbye!